were times where I was really frustrated waiting in the office for hours and thinking to myself, like, God, we could just have a phone call for five minutes and it'd be easier. But I never thought that one day that would actually be what, you know, what's happening. COVID-19 changed almost every aspect of our lives, including what we left our houses for. And now Manitoba's largest university is conducting a survey on the impacts of virtual doctor's appointments. Since COVID started, probably probably over 20. That's Tamara Showedway, who says she saved hours and hours of time avoiding waiting rooms and driving to appointments. She's currently seeing multiple doctors and says it just feels better doing the majority of her appointments where she's comfortable. I find that the the phone appointments are way easier, no waiting, and it's just quick and easy and you get it over with. I don't have to leave work, right? Like I can just be like, I'm taking a break and I go in the back and they have my doctor's appointment and, you know, don't have to go anywhere, don't have to take time off. So that's very handy as well. It had certain advantages and also challenges for both for me, for example, and the person who I saw. Dr. Mandana Motorusa works both at the university and St. Boniface Hospital. She's seen firsthand clear advantages for both herself and patients similar to what Shodway found, but also saw challenges in patients who didn't know how to use FaceTime technology or had bad internet connections. Motorusa wants doctors and patients to take the survey in hopes that some of the switch to virtual can stay post-pandemic. The survey is asking for your experience, challenges, and what you'd like to see changed. We don't anticipate it disappears. So in order to better provide the best care, uh, it's the first step is to see how we've done and which part we need to modify. Uh, we hope that uh, the results of this survey helps uh, policymakers in healthcare system. As for Showedway, she's hoping for some small changes to the system. It comes from a private number, so I mean, I myself usually don't answer private numbers, but I'm, you know, waiting for this call. And sometimes it is, it takes like an hour and a half past my appointment. And I mean, sometimes you have things to do, right? So I, I think it'd be handier if they scheduled them. I know they're doing it from home or wherever, but scheduled them more farther apart so they have time to be on time for a phone appointment. In Winnipeg, Mike Albanese, City News.